<clears throat> I'm not afraid. I'm not scared. Whatever happens, it's going to happen. Right. But he was very, very calm. You know, he didn't have any. Um, he wasn't. Um, he didn't seem to have any fear. Worries. Fear. Right. Right. And um, so we stayed there. We sat there for a minute trying to figure out our next move. The next thing we know, Jeremiah and Jay people came. I don't know how they got back there. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they did. I don't know how we met them. I don't remember how we got to them. Right. But we, the next thing I know, we're with them, and they are meeting us to the airport. They're getting us out of town. Okay. Right? And it's late. It's like about 1 or 2 in the morning. It's still chaos. Right. And they're leading us out of the spot, and they're leading us to the airport. And we had to change airports. I think we flew in in Chicago to O'Hara, mm -hmm. but we had to leave at Mid Midway. Okay. We had to okay. switch airports. Switch airports. Because they knew, uh, I guess, the game the was the proximity close yeah, to where they exactly. were. Okay. You right. know what I'm saying? Okay. So they did all that for us. I don't, or why tiny? I don't, I don't know who quite did it. Right. But I just know that that's what ended up happening. Okay. Somebody probably made a phone call. I think it was or something time. like that. Like, yeah, because I'm. Was that what was that ninety two? They had cell phones back then. Yeah, yeah. I said, yeah, we had cell. It was the big one, the big, yeah, the big, big block goofy ones. looking cell phone. <laughs> yeah. So wow, amazing. Yeah. So, uh, they got us to the airport safely. We okay. came back to Atlanta. About a week later, we get a phone call. I actually get a phone call from one of Jay's people, and they say, yo. The gangs to say you guys can come back. Just don't tell Pac, don't come back on that bullshit no more. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Wow. Y'all can come back. Y'all good. But don't come back with that bullshit. And I never forget that because, like, who, like, not many people in that life right. will extend that kind of olive branch to you after you come on a turf and offend them. Right, or they feel disrespect, or feel disrespect. Yes, That's sir. the word I'm looking for. Absolutely. Yeah, more than offense. It's a disrespect. Right. Yeah, downright a violation. Right. You know what I'm saying? Not many gangsters will extend an olive branch of forgiveness to you right. after that. After you have transgressed that way. Yeah, facts. But they did that for Pop, and now I thought that was interesting. I was like, wow, still got, you know, he's just more than. An average rapper. This dude has some type of influence right. on people, or he has the power to influence people. The right? charisma. The charisma. Yeah, but yeah. not only just the charisma, but the the, the ability to uh, uh, stand on a principle right. 